Hello Libra and welcome to me Tarot Owl. Today we're going to be doing your weekly reading, tarot card reading, and I'm also going to be pulling one of these cards to see what you need to hear. This, these, this card here is going to be something that you need to hear, Libra, something you need to hear this week about yourself. <laughs> you have shake, release, and heal, and move on. Shake, release, and heal. So, shake off all your worries. Shake off all those, uh, let's just say, dead dreams. Shake off all the, shake off all your worries and all your fears this week, and release them, and just move on. Just move on. That. You know, because if that's just it's going to be causing you anxiety, you don't want anxiety. Take these antlers off the, not off, but take the long antlers of this gazelle here. Gazelles move very fast and very quickly through the through the uh, I want to say desert, but it's not really the desert, the savanna, the savanna. You know, they move very quickly. They blend it. The sun comes down on them, and it's very hard to see them because of their coloring as well. So. It wants you to, to just release all the release all your anxieties. Um, go for a walk. Go for a walk. Do something you enjoy. Don't run away from your problems. You have to release them, and then then you'll be able to move to move. We'll go ahead and move on and move forward. So you know, go maybe do some meditation, um, or just do something that that you can clear your mind with. Do something that you enjoy. Do something you enjoy this week to, to help release this tension. And because um, you don't want to carry this, you don't want to carry your your baggage around, let's say. Because it's just going to cause you more anxiety. You want to be like, you want to you want to take these, you want to go by leaps and bounds. You want to be like this gazelle and just <clears throat> kind of like glide and Kind of like glide and fly along. You know, let let the antlers, like I was saying, let those cut the let those cut the cords and cut the um, the clouds of all this uh, anxiety and anguish that may be coming on to you this week. This gazelle's here to help you cut through all that. I want you to go get out there and enjoy yourself and do something that you want to do. Leave the fears behind. Don't be frightened to try something new. Something to help you release all this stagnant energy that might be around you and causing you anxiety. Let's go. We have the five, the five of Pentacles here. Trudging through the trudging through the coldness, the darkness. You're not. You weren't prepared. For, you're not prepared for this. Uh, fives can be conflicts. But again, if you, if, they, if these people walking along here that are that are feeling feeling down and constricted, you know the, the cold air is constricting their their blood vessels. They're they're cold. It's dark. You know they're depressed. In other words, um, you know, take the energy. You know, let's take this energy from this gazelle here and bring it into this picture. This card is telling you to to raise your head up and, and to go ahead and, and look, and look at, and and look around. Raise above, raise above this anxiety that's bringing coming forward to you this week. And you can see these beautiful church. You'll be able to see this beautiful light, this beautiful um, stained glass window here. Like I was saying, maybe perhaps you know you can meditate or or do something that you always dreamed of doing this week. Um, you wanna you wanna snap out of this snap out of this coldness snap out of the coldness. Don't don't live in your past. Don't live in the past. Don't live in the past. This week's coming through as well. Don't live in the past. Yeah. Don't don't go back and visit the past. 
as you can see here in this card, you know, the, the people, or what's, what could be bringing you anxiety, up, maybe about a situation or some people here. Now he, he's looking back. He's looking back at them. Don't don't go revisit your past. Those people aren't even there anymore. As you can tell, they they're walked away. They're on their own new paths now. And once this this message is for you to stay in the present. Don't feel so constricted. Don't constrict yourself to the past. Because it'll only bring anxiety, perhaps uh, you know, sad memories or something. You you need to stop having these constrictions upon yourself. It's time for you to move forward. Move forward. You have your you have your tools. You now this this person here. This is you here. You have your tools now. You have two, you know, you're holding two up and you have one in your hand, so you've got tools under your belt. You're ready to go. You're ready to go. You're ready to, to reach this light, this enlightenment, this enlightenment of this beautiful stained glass window. It's time for you to stop revisiting the past. Stop revisiting the past. Stop holding on, holding on, holding on. Look at this, look at this person. Holding and grasping so tightly, afraid, afraid that he's going to lose, this, he's afraid he's going to lose something that he's worked for all his life. Don't be afraid to go for your goals. Don't be afraid to go for your goals. Stop revisiting the past. You don't need to clutch on to everything. You don't need to clutch all that past. You don't need to clutch on to it and, and bury it underneath your feet. Hold it on, you know, and hold it close to your stomach like this. Heaven's sakes, you don't want ulcers, right? You don't want ulcers. Get rid of this anxiety. You got the moon coming in. The moon going through all its phases. You got the wild and the tame side here of the of these dogs. We've got this lobster coming up out of the water. Watch to, to go ahead and, and go through that, take this new path. The lobster says, it's time for you to come out of your shell. Stop being so worried. Stop worrying yourself. You want to shake and release it and, and move on. You want to shake, shake it off, shake it off. Shake off your fears. Now you got the tame side, the wild side. You've got the barking at the moon and the howling at the moon. Also got the sun here now. The sun's trying to peek out for you, for you to see, for you to see this light. Stop living in the past. And then once you can get through that and realize that you don't need to hold on to all these, you don't need to hold on to all those things. All those things. There's a celebration here. It's going to be abundant. There'll be abundance in the harvest. It's also got pumpkins on it. This is October coming into October now. The harvest, the collecting of the collecting of what's been growing and working. It's time for you to harvest. Harvest. Do some harvesting of your thoughts and release and release it. It's time for you to release. It's time for you to release so you can celebrate and move on. It's just stop holding in all those uh, quit revisiting the past. I just can't keep saying it so I'm gonna stop because that's all I'm getting right. It's really all I'm getting here for you Libra. Is there someone or some people that have to just Libras that just need to uh, Shake, release, and heal. Shake, release, and heal, and move on. Get out of your past. 